Oh gosh, I didn't think this through. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, my name's Alexa Ray, and welcome to another video. I'm so glad you're here, and I'm so glad you clicked on today's video. I am so, so excited, because you guys already know, I am so big on doing book hauls on my channel. I love, love, love getting new books. This is definitely a spur of the moment type of video, because originally, I was going to combine this video with another video. I had ordered like five or six books, and then today, I received so so much book mail it like had me in tears okay so I want to sit down with you guys today and talk about all the new books I got I'm so so excited because there are so many books in this haul that I have been dying to get my hands on they are books that I cannot wait to read especially for the summertime we have a lot of summer vibes in here we also have some other books that are kind of not in the romance genre they're more leaning towards mystery thriller and I'm super excited about that because I haven't really read too many books in that genre and I really want to branch out this year jump into new and different genres I usually stay in the romance genre it's my comfort one so I'm really excited to have some new books to kind of push me in to new genres but yeah we are going to be doing a book haul today I am so very excited I also am doing a giveaway in today's video which I'm going to talk more to you guys about in a few minutes I wanted to give back to you guys because without you this wouldn't be possible so I want to show my appreciation and show my love to you guys by doing a giveaway we have a ton of books to tell in today's video so without further ado let's hop into it before we jump into the book haul I want to talk to you guys about the giveaway I'm going to be doing in today's video I am so excited because it's actually going to be my first ever giveaway I've ever done on my channel this is going to be very exciting I wanted to do a giveaway now because not only have we hit so many milestones on my channel over the last few months but I also recently reorganized my entire library my bookshelves all of that stuff and I decided to clear out some of the books I have I have all these books now that I really just want to give back to you guys because without you guys we wouldn't be here talking about books every day having fun so this is my way of giving back and just showing how much I love you guys and appreciate each and every one of you every day your comments and messages don't go unnoticed I literally read every single one of them and they make my heart so happy and full I'm gonna share each bundle with you there's going to be five winners there's five different book bundles there's three books in each bundle because it is my first giveaway I am going to keep it open to only US addresses only only. I am so sorry to all my international lovies. I love you guys so much. I'm hoping in the future when we do another giveaway, maybe 100k or something like that, I will do an international giveaway so you guys who live in other countries can also participate. But for this giveaway specifically, it's going to be US based only. I'm so sorry. I want to make sure everything goes smoothly and I don't mess anything up. Honestly, it's super easy to enter. All you have to do is follow my main Instagram, which is Alexa Fadley Amoya, and then also follow my bookstagram, which is Alexa Ray's Library. If you follow both of those accounts, then you can message me on my main one, Alexa Fadley Amoya, and just let me know that you follow both of my accounts, and then you'll be entered in the giveaway. The first bundle I have is a Good Girl's Guide to Murder series. I have book one, book two, and book three in this bundle. Book three is a hardcover. Such an incredible YA murder mystery series. Next up, I am doing a Coho bundle. This is the Maybe Someday series. We have book one. Book two is a short little novella, and then book three is Maybe Now. A lot of people are telling me how these covers aren't even being published anymore so these are like pretty special I guess you could say. Next up we're doing a little romance bundle. I have Addicted You by Krista and Becca Ritchie. This is book one in the Addicted series. I have Maggie Moves On by Lucy Score but this is actually like a pre-release version. And then I have To All the Boys I've Loved Before by Jenny Han. This is going to be bundle number three. For bundle number four I was kind of going for like an 1800s romance bundle. We have A Lady's Guide to Mischief and Mayhem and An Heiress Guide to Deception and Desire. These are both by Amanda Collins. And then I also added in Mr. Malcolm's List by Suzanne Allen. And then the last bundle I have is kind of like a self-help, self-love bundle. We have You Are a Badass by Jen Sicaro. Untamed by Glennon Doyle. This is such an incredible book. I highly recommend. And then I have Almost Adulting by Arden Rose. Don't forget, all you have to do to enter is follow my main Instagram, which is Alexa Fadley Amoya. Also follow my bookstagram, which is Alexa Ray's Library. Message me on my main letting me know you followed it and you'll be entered in the giveaway 
we are gonna jump right into the book haul so many books in this haul right now are books that i've just wanted for the longest time we also have some new releases in here so the first two books that i'm gonna share with you guys were actually gifts from one of you and i have the little note here it says hi alexa i love your channel i hope you enjoy these books enjoy your gift from stephanie thank you so much stephanie for sending me these books this was on my amazon wish list and i'm so so excited for these so we have meet me at the lake by carly fortune this literally just came out like a few days ago so i'm so excited to read this i also have to read her other book which is every summer after i do have that one and they are both going to be on my summer tbr and then we have the love wager by lynn painter i have just recently started getting into her books and i love her writing style her books are such easygoing reads so i am very excited for this one both of these covers are absolutely gorgeous next up we have coach and the birthday list these are both by devney perry they actually came from devney perry herself and i literally was fangirling when i got the package because i was like there's no way there's no way he sent me books right coach has actually been on my wish list for the longest time probably since it came out i'm really excited because it's like a football romance but there's also a single dad trope in here and then i also got the birthday list which i haven't really heard or seen too much on but i know it's going to be amazing because it's Stephanie perry next up we have the good girl complex and bad girl reputation these are both by l kennedy who is the author of the off-campus series those are like hockey romances that i've really been loving i'm a really big fan of her writing style her storytelling her characters so when i saw that she had these books i was like i gotta try them out not to mention they give off all of the summer vibes which i'm super excited about so these are both part of the avalon bay series this is book one and this is book two and then book three is coming out sometime this year i think but i really want to pick those up because they give off all of the summery vibe next up we have daisy hates by jessa hastings this is book two in the magnolia parks universe i read magnolia parks last month and i fell in love with that book i'm obsessed with it i love the characters the story was just it was crazy like the craziest story ever i know it's a very controversial book and series overall because it's a very toxic relationship there's a lot of crazy things that happen in it that can be kind of triggering for people so i could see why a lot of people don't necessarily like the books but i personally liked book one because it was just a roller coaster of emotions for me i literally couldn't put it down like i had to see what happened next i ended up loving it more so for the drama and gossip in it, it kind of gives off gossip girl vibes i finished that book last month and i immediately went to pick up book two because also these covers in the series are absolutely gorgeous i hear a lot of people say that they love daisy hates over magnolia park so i'm very excited to see like what this is all about i'm pretty sure it gives off mafia vibes so i think that's gonna be really fun next up i have part of your world by abby jimenez i recently got sent yours truly which is also by her and i went to start reading it but then i realized i think it's part of a series and when i looked it up it is in the same universe as part of your world so i decided to pick this up so i could read it first and then jump into yours truly i think we see characters from this book in yours truly and i didn't want to get confused or spoil anything so i decided to pick this one up i know last year this was a huge and popular book that a lot of people really love and i've recently seen a lot of people pick up yours truly and talk about it and say incredible things so i really want to read these two books this summer because i think they're going to be amazing next up i picked up some cutie little books that i feel like i haven't seen a lot on honestly we have to love jason thorne and to hate adam connor by ella mays these are absolutely adorable these covers just give off rom-com vibes i think this one may be an enemies to lovers trope and then this one might be a friends to lovers trope it says on the back my brother's childhood friend it could be brother's best friend trope i wanted to pick these up because they look absolutely adorable i honestly think these are the cutest spines i have ever seen now we're going to be hopping in to some mystery thriller reads which i am super super excited about because some of these i haven't even heard of before i'm very intrigued by them so i have these itty bitty books and i think they all belong in the same series they're by Marin stoffels we have room service fright night which looks honestly terrifying and then escape room which also looks equally terrifying we have these three little books they're very short honestly i think they're like 100 pages maybe they're 200 pages i was 100 pages off they're 200 pages they're itty bitty books yeah these give off some very spooky vibes these were sent to me by underlined i don't know if i will tackle them during the summertime just because they give off really scary vibes i think they'll be really fun reads though during spooky season and in october next up we have we were liars and family of liars by e lockhart 
I have actually had We Were Liars for the longest time, but I've always been afraid to pick it up because I've seen a lot of mixed reviews on it. People either love it or they think it's the dumbest book ever. So I've kind of put it off, especially because it was super hyped up last summer, but I feel like enough time has passed where I can finally hop into it and give it a try. I was also sent the second book of the series, which I think is a prequel to this one. So it's gonna be super exciting to give these a try this summer. They give off summer vibes because I think it takes place at a beach house or a lake house. I think it's a murder mystery, but I'm not entirely sure. Next up, I have One of Us is Lying and One of Us is Next. These are by Karen M. McManus. I've heard nothing but good things about these books. I know it's also turned into a show, I think on Amazon or Peacock, one of those. I know it's a show though. I'm so excited to read these because it kind of gives off Breakfast Club vibes, but murder mystery. We have a thriller series by Natasha Preston. Book one is The Fear. Book two is The Lake and book three is The Twin. I don't think I've honestly seen these books anywhere before so I'm super excited to see what they're all about. I am a little intimidated by thrillers just because I do read a lot of romance. I'm definitely a romance girly on my channel, you guys already know. I do think it'd be really fun to get into thrillers. I feel like a lot of these books I'll probably save for the fall and spooky season because it'll just be more fitting. Next up we have a series that I did start. I haven't finished just yet but I I loved book one so very much. This story was so, so crazy. And it is a Good Girl's Guide to Murder series. They sent me the entire series in hardcover form. I wanted to get my hands on the full box set of hardcovers for the longest time. Book one is A Good Girl's Guide to Murder. It's such a good YA mystery. It wasn't too spooky or scary. Book two is Good Girl, Bad Blood. I hear just as amazing things in this book as I do from the first one. And then book three is As Good as Dead. I hear really mixed reviews on this one. Like, I hear a lot of people don't really like this book, and they say that Pip's character is just... She's not Pip in this book, so I'm kind of scared to get to it, but at the same time, I'm very excited because I want to see what everyone's talking about when they say she's, like, different. She's not who she was in the first book. But that is all for my book haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you had fun. This was a spur-of-the-moment type of video, but I was really excited when I got all these books today. I wanted to sit down and share them with you immediately and also talk about the giveaway. I talked about doing a giveaway in a few videos back and I've just been waiting for the right time to do it. So don't forget if you guys want to take part in my giveaway, it's open to US addresses only. All you have to do to enter is follow my main Instagram which is Alexa Fadley Amoya and then also follow my bookstagram which is Alexa Ray's Library. Once you've done that, just message me on my main account letting me know that you followed both accounts and you'll be entered in the giveaway. I'll probably keep it open for the rest of the month which gives you two weeks to enter and I'll pick the winners on June 1st. There's five packages so there's five winners. It's just my way of saying thank you and showing my love and appreciation. This is literally a dream come true. I love sitting here every day talking about books with you guys. It's literally my favorite thing in the entire world. Definitely stay tuned for all the reading vlogs that are going to be featuring these books over the next few months. But yeah, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I love you guys so, so much and I'll see you in my next video.